The Tacoma bed rack is gone. But now what? I have plans. Good morning, everybody. How are you today? And that's right. My Toyota Tacoma bed rack is gone. This was a bed rack that I had from RCI Metalworks. And I really did like the bed rack. I thought it looked great on the truck. Um, had some plans, decided to go a little bit of a different route. Go figure, right? Uh, so I took it off and I actually sold it. It is gone. Um, fella named Jose on the channel picked it up here locally and he's gonna use it to put uh, a tent on the back of his awesome cement Toyota Tacoma. So congrats to him for picking that up and thank you very much, I appreciate it. But what are my plans? What are we gonna do next? Well, I mentioned in a couple other videos about uh, the possibility of putting a roll bar or a sport bar, or I guess some people even call them beauty bars. Sounds like some kind of bath soap, right? Well, I'm not putting bath soap on the back of the truck. Heck, I don't even like most of the time putting soap on the truck, you know, like washing it. Um, but I am going to go with what I'm going to call a sport bar. Um, they're not really roll bars anymore because they can't support the weight of the truck. I, I had heard someone left a comment about they had billed them as roll bars in the past. And then somebody, of course, went out, rolled their truck and uh, it didn't support the weight of the truck which of course they wouldn't. If you're familiar with them, they really just attach these days to the side rails. Some of them you have to drill, some you don't. I'm not drilling my side rail, right? Uh, the one that I'm gonna get, I actually have on order, uh, bolts down to the track system, uh, the same as the, uh, the bed rack that I had did. Little fasteners that fit in that track and then you tighten them down with bolts. Now, this is a little bit different. On one of my previous videos, I posted a picture of a roll bar or a sport bar that I had on my Ram Rebel. It's a little bit different than that. Um, and I actually did have to drill for that. I actually drilled holes in the rail. Don't know why I ever did that. Uh, I'll call it just being too green. Uh, I could have put some kind of track system on there and taken care of it that way. Definitely not drilling holes this time. Um, because, as I mentioned, I have the, the side rails, they'll just screw in. But what I'm going to get, it's from a company called, uh, well, it actually comes from Extreme Terrain. But the manufacturer is Black Forest. And coincidentally, it's called the Black Forest Gladiator Sport Bar, I think. And of course, I have a Gladiator here. And ironically, uh, the bed size on the Gladiator and the Tacoma back there is the same, at least close enough that you're able to swap things back and forth as far as this sport bar goes and even the tonneau cover that I have on there right now. So it comes from a company called Black Forest. It's called the Gladiator. And it is, as I mentioned, just a little bit different. Um, than what I've had in the past. The way it's gonna work, it of course has the uh, tubing uh, that's gonna come down here off of the side and then connect across the front, of course. You've probably seen roll bars before, right? But anyway, it's gonna come down to about right in this area somewhere here. Now, it carries on with a flat, I'll call it kind of tubular bar that's going to extend back to somewhere about in this area right here uh, from the pictures I, I have seen. Now, the reason that I've decided to go with this one, you know, when you put a roll bar, sport bar, on the back of a double cab truck, it shortens the truck. It kind of makes it look shorter for some crazy reason. And I noticed this when I had it on the Ram Rebel. Um, it just made the truck look stubbier. I don't know why. And I think probably that's because of the double cab and the shorter bed to begin with. It kind of accentuates uh, that shorter bed. So when I saw this one, I got to thinking, you know, 
the rails that come down the side, extending the rack, if you will, or the, the sport bar, um, might actually elongate the look of that sport bar itself. And then I wouldn't have that kind of stubbier looking appearance, if you will, that you get sometimes when you put a sport bar on a double cab truck. And by the way, let me say, I do think that roll bars, sport bars, uh, look the best on just single cab trucks. I really do. Maybe even an access cab. But I do like them on the double cab as well. Now, one other thing I wanted to mention with this, um, it does have a plate on the side. So it has the bars, if you will, the tubes that come down to form the, the roll bar. And then in between the tube that goes down next to the cab and then that curving tube is a plate. And I've mentioned before that I'm not real hip on those plates. And especially since the manufacturers kind of use that plate to advertise their product. Within that plate, it will say, I believe it says Black Force and I think it's in red. I'm not exactly sure. So I'm kind of up in the air what I'm gonna do about that. Um, I thought about just painting that lettering black so that it kind of just fades in. You'll still be able to see it, but it won't be this beacon of company name on the side of the truck, right? Then I thought, well, maybe I'll just go completely the other way. Go ahead with the advertisement, if you will, and paint it voodoo blue so that it matches the truck. Then you would see the black forest lettering um, quite predominantly on the side of the truck with that plate. The other thing I was thinking about, there's really two more options. One is to just not put the plate in. You don't have to include it. Um, although it does give a little bit more support, I guess, in those bars. Um, or come up with some kind of a custom plate myself. If I can find somebody that can fab up a plate that says, Rob Motive on the side, right? I mean, the channel name. I think that would be kind of cool um, with some kind of a design or something. I don't know how feasible that is. Uh, it's probably nothing I can do myself. I don't have the equipment, and frankly, I'm just not that talented. Uh, but it would be neat to find some kind of a shop, or maybe there's somebody out there um, that can do something like that. You know, I could send the dimensions uh, with the holes that it screws into or whatever. I have to see actually how it goes on the truck and what it looks like. But I think that would be pretty cool. And who knows, might put something other than the channel name, I don't know, like, how you doing? Nah, I, I don't know, something like that. But anyway, that's the plan so far, um, as far as that little side panel goes. It is on order, should be here within the next week or so, and then uh, we'll get it installed. I can't imagine it's much to install. It will come in pieces, of course, I think. Uh, so there will be some assembly to it, but it's all bolt together, bolt on, no drilling, nothing like that. And it's going to be interesting to see what the truck looks like. I do ha I have to admit, um, I do like the truck without it. It actually makes the truck look a little bit bigger, I think, without having that bed rack on. I don't know why, um, but it just kind of gives the illusion, if you will, since I've had it on especially, that somehow the truck is a little bit beefier, a little bit bigger. Kind of strange. Anyway, that's what's going on. I have it coming. Uh, stay tuned. You can see what it looks like, and I'm sure everybody out there will tell me how much they love it. I'm sure there'll be some that don't. Anyway, leave a comment. Let me know what you think so far of my idea. Are you a sport bar fan, a bed rack fan, or just leave it alone the way that it is? I'd be curious to know. Also, real quick, if you're interested, Check out my other channel. It is Rob Motive JT, all about my 2020 Jeep Gladiator. Don't forget to click that notification bell so that you don't miss out on any upcoming videos. And do me a favor, smash that subscribe button on the way out. Thanks for watching. Stay safe out there. Bye.